Today I would like to talk to you about the liver. The liver is the largest organ in the body. You can cut half of the liver away and it has the power to regenerate. The liver is your life giver. The quality of life is dependent on the quality of the liver. The muscles, tendons, eyes and your strength are controlled and fed by the liver. Remember, the heart is a muscle. According to Tao, it is believed that the female reproductive organ is controlled by the liver and all the diseases of the female parts are treated taking consideration of this organ. Blood pressure, cortisol, insulin and fats are all under the influence of the liver. There is a balancing act between cortisol and DHEA. DHEA is an endogenous hormone secreted by the adrenal glands. DHEA serves as a precursor to male and female sex hormones. When cortisol level goes up, DHEA level comes down. And when DHEA level goes up, cortisol level comes down. Raised cortisol will lead to raised blood sugar, which will bring about raised insulin resistance, resulting in a metabolic disorder and a buildup of fats in the liver. The cause of type 2 diabetes and obesity. This organ speaks to the thyroid gland and is one of the organs that assist in converting T4 to T3. Estrogen and thyroxine binding globulins are made by the liver. Thyroxine binding globulins bind to T4 to convert into T3. But high levels of estrogen raises the production of thyroxine binding globulins which lowers the number of T4 available to convert into T3 causing hypothyroidism which inevitably leads to diabetes and obesity. The liver also acts as a warehouse and stores the nutrients to be released to the body as needed, similar to the fuel tank in your car. The faster you drive the car, the more fuel you use up. Hence, those who live on the fast track inevitably have a shorter lifespan. On this note, it is wise to be aware the more you eat, the lazier you get. And this can lead to diseased state of body and mind. Now, if your car demanded more fuel and you get less miles per gallon, then you will soon have it seen to. In the same way, we should consider the body. There is no excuse to be made saying he is a growing lad and needs more food. If you are putting on fat as a result, then you can be sure you are not burning off the calories. Input should match output. In the East, we believe the liver is a seat of the soul and love is stowed in the liver, which is expressed by the heart. We say in the East, I love you with my heart and liver. In the West, we have a similar saying, I love you with my heart and my soul. In the scriptures, it is said that the spirit flows in the blood and we have blood that feeds the liver. The purer the blood, the better quality the liver. Before you can love another, you must learn to love your liver. In the process of digestion, the liver drains the bile into the gallbladder. Regular draining of the liver causes harmony within. 
But if the gold bladder does not empty, then this can bring about anger. The Tao say, anger destroys the liver. In the West, we say, anger destroys the soul. If a person has no regard for the liver, be aware, they can never truly love you, no matter what sweet words they use to seduce you. It is important to know there is no free meal where drugs are concerned. All drugs and pharmaceuticals make their way to the liver. It can be stored here and do optimum damage to the organ and its function. Contaminant Contaminated foods Smoking Excess alcohol Parasites Viruses Worms and household chemicals, including cosmetics, harm the liver one way or another. To improve the quality of the liver, it is wise to detoxify and cleanse the organ. I recommend herbal liver mix that will assist the liver to function better and it will also help to get rid of the liver fluke which is very easy to acquire and very hard to get rid of. The liver fluke is believed to cause many unnecessary problems, bringing about a diseased state of body and mind. The liver goes out of its way to nourish and protect you. Greater love no man will ever have. Now, do you love your liver? Nelson Brampton Natural Healing Centre